two plays that I want to show you guys, and this is out of single back, wing, flex, close. These two plays can defeat 99% of the looks in Madden. Um, what you're going to want to do is identify whether they're in a man or a zone look. I would suggest that if they're in a zone look, that you do this formation right here. There is only one read for you to make. Technically, there's two, and that would the second read would be scramble with your quarterback. I want you to block everybody that you can possibly can out of this formation and slide your offensive line to the right. It's not necessary to do so, but it's going to allow you to have a better chance to escape out of the pocket, especially if you don't have an escape artist quarterback. The reason for square being on a streak is because that will allow you to playmaker Tyreek Hill in... in if you need him to immediately move up on this crossing route, it should open this play up for big games. Here's an example of that. That was actually a pretty bad playmaker. You saw him open earlier, but still, this play cooks. This will defeat Wait, cover two, um, uh, cover two man. It will take almost every single zone coverage in the game and take it out of the picture. And the playmaker what? is just kind of something that I do for fun in this. Um, it, it's just. Uh, there if you, if you need it, especially if you have someone usering it. If you know that someone is usering your wide receiver on this route, that is why you can stick with that one read look. Um, traditionally, you would like to use this play on the left side of the field and have him run left to right, uh, but as you can see here, it's kind of even more so on the right side of the hashes right there. This is just going to get way open. You just pass lead up, throw it, touchdown, easy. So I know what you guys are thinking. You're probably thinking, that is dumb as hell. You know, somebody's going to look at that, or I don't want to run outside with my quarterback all the time, or anything like that. People are going to over to commit to stop it. With this, it's kind of, you can revert immediately to this play. It's same formation. It's smash. I call it bench because it's a bench look. What you're going to do is the same thing. Although I typically put my running back or my inside tight end on a streak just because it's a little bit redundant to block eight people your reads are simple if square opens up throw to square immediately you cannot throw pardon me you cannot throw late if you see him open it's hot hike and he's not open here a throw like that that is going to beat any cover threes or anything like that where they're not playing a hard flat so if you see that square is not open this might not actually work because I think this is actually a cover three and I'm not on the left side of the field. But that, it's going to be a simple corner to that. Just for ease of access, I'm going to show you guys right now what happens when this goes against cover two man or any kind of, we'll just put on any kind of man coverage. We'll do the same play. Single back wing flex close. Smash. Concept. Man. I don't even want man blitz. Let's make it cover two man to make it even harder on ourselves. So right now they have the safety help. It won't matter. That play is going to destroy cover two, cover four, cover six, and anybody that is overcommitted to stop your PA cross country. If for whatever reason you can see that they're like they have using zone adjustments, and zone drops to change all of this, I like to do a little Texas route in here. And I don't even really need to go through it. I'm sure you guys can see why. If you see that those two reads are open, at least you'll have the Texas. If they are still, now they are pissed off and they know, okay, I have two plays to cover. The one variant I like to run here, and I actually like to have another streak out of my tight end, is they're going to overcommit to both of those plays and that zig route right here. Anybody that has route, um, route technician, if they're going to get wide open unless the user is covering it. So, I mean, that's basically everything with the scheme. This scheme is just a pick-your-poison kind of thing. As long as you know, and this is cover two man again, you can see that safety just freeze there. If you can trick them, it's going to be a bit, there's a big chance it's going to be a touchdown. I'm interested to see personally how this is going to work against a prevent-style defense. That's Asante Samuel Jr. right there. So that's a 95 speed in this franchise cornerback with one step ahead. See a double high safety look. I mean, this play is just money. Just make sure you're pass leading left on this on the smash, and that you're pass leading right or up or up right on that PA cross country. Um, I can try to show you guys one last bit here where maybe I can get him to do. This one I wouldn't necessarily do that. I was going to try to show you that playmaker. Anytime you don't have that deep safety look, that playmaker is going to be deadly. And that playmaker will only work with this setup right here. If you have your running back on a flat, anything like that, the playmaker works with the, to the receiver that's closest to you. So there's
there's no sense again of throwing that playmaker. But yeah, that's, all, that's basically all I wanted to show you guys. It's a really easy scheme to work with. I mean, everything else in it, the dives, the stretches, the tosses in this formation, I don't think you guys need a video to see how that works. There's plenty of plays in it. Um, just to close out this video, I will show you guys some of them. But really, just those two plays alone are going to give you the backbone of an offense that you can go and to build into something like gun tight end offset or single back doubles north or, or south rather which has again a, a bench look and it has some crossers and stuff like that i'm not a big crossers guy outside of that cross country play uh pa double cross is okay at best so yeah um it, it, that this formation right here you can run and you can build kind of your own audible passes out of it i i don't like to run pretty much um let me find it again I don't like to run any of these other plays really stock. I know Clown Post is a good man beater. I don't like the screen out of this. I do like HB Zone Weak, and I do like the, um, what is it, this one, the Zone Fake Jet. The only other one I really like is this four verticals, and that's just simply because I think it's a really nice um, running back route. It's kind of like one of those unique ones when they don't get caught on your line. But yeah, it's just one of those ones. I like the running back routes, routes that work almost like an out or an in route. Um, where you can kind of see how it's bent over there around that corner. It's going to give them kind of like a nice extra little cut at the end. So that being said, that's that's basically it. Everything else you can explore from there, but those two plays alone should make it a really deadly setup for you guys, and it should open up your offense a lot more. So with that being said, I'd appreciate a like and subscribe if this helped you, and you guys be good. And if you need anything, just leave a comment. I'll, uh, I'll answer as, much, or as many comments as I can. Thank you.